Well, the evidence is clear. COVID vaccines prevent severe illness and save lives, but researchers haven't stopped looking for other forms of treatment. So what if taking pills or an antiviral infusion was all it took to get better? Tiffany Liu shows us how a doctor in North Texas is testing two new drugs. For some doctors, it's a calling, right? They live and breathe for research. That is absolutely the best hope we can have. For Dr. Harash Bogara, he sees how important clinical trials are. In last eight years, I have been involved in multiple different trials, different indications, but last year has been pretty much the most rewarding clinical trial that we have done. We met him a year ago at Epic Medical Research. Dr. Bagara was doing monoclonal antibody trials, now a widely used treatment for COVID patients. Thousands of people are getting benefited from uh, as we speak. He and his colleagues are currently testing two new drugs that could also help people who test positive. The Pfizer pill is one of those trials. The pill is twice a day just like Tamiflu for five days. 25% of the subjects get placebo pills, but for the other 75%, they take ritonavir, an existing antiviral drug with the Pfizer pill. Combining these two has the best effect. That's why they're together. So patients will be taking one from here, one from here. The second clinical trial is the antiviral infusion. Yes, this is the infusion and the medication comes out. Both vaccinated way, and uh, unvaccinated people can qualify. This is minus 20. The trial is one infusion for about one hour. Four out of five get the real drug. For both trials, Dr. Bagara says it's promising. It's doing what it's supposed to be doing and had a very positive data. And he knows there are many more COVID trials to come. In Red Oak, I'm Tiffany Liu.